What's up ladies and gentlemen, this is Tony with Android Spin. Today's a pretty exciting day here in the Android community, uh, especially if you own the original Asus EEE Pad Transformer TF101. Today's the day that ice cream sandwich is rolling out, kids. I woke up this morning and was pleased to find a software update. Android 4.0.3, baby. Um, if you haven't already gotten the update, all you have to do is go into your system settings, check for a firmware update. Mine was already there and waiting. I'll go ahead and give you a quick look at all the settings and stuff here. Got Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, data storage. Data storage looks a little different than what it has in the past. And that gives you a breakdown of everything how much data that you've used you can set different time periods which I only have the one for right now we got sounds display storage battery apps we've got Asus customized settings this is where you will find your screenshot capturing feature Alright, what else do we have here? There's one thing that I checked right away and noticed that it did not have and I was quite disappointed. There is no uh, no face unlock. Come on, what's up Asus? We want a face unlock too, you know. Now we've still got the Asus overlay as you can see with the little buttons there. It's only a slight overlay, nothing too major. And we have camera support. We've got video camera support. And we also have this new feature here. Some of you may have already seen it. It is panorama mode. Basically, let's see if I can do this. I don't think I'm going to be able to do it while holding the camera and the tablet. Sorry guys, you'll have to just test it out for yourself. But the panorama mode is very sweet. It basically lets you take... Uh, panoramic images from your tablet um, let's see we also have some stuff in the calendar here that's new we've got pinch to zoom very nice new feature Looks like we've got another uh, new live wallpaper as well. I'll go in and check out the browser. And it tells me right away I need to download Adobe Flash, so we'll go ahead and do that. And installed nice and speedy. 
or installing I guess downloaded pretty speedy and we're installed so we'll go back back again and there we've got our browser Ah, eh, forget the Google blog I know what web page I'm going to I'll go ahead and turn it on to normal view. Start it out in mobile, it looks like. And we're back. Sorry about that, guys. My SD card kind of uh, filled up on me there, so I had to switch over. But we're back. We're looking at AndroidSpin.com on the browser. Go ahead and uh, show you the post that I looked at first things first this morning. Ice cream sandwich update is now live for the Asus EEE Pad Transformer. Now I'm just pretty much waiting on. Uh, some custom ROMs to come out. I know it'll probably be a few days before we see anything like that. Um, I am currently unrooted. Uh, this is stock, complete from ASUS, 100% what they want their customers to have at the moment. Um, sorry ASUS, but I will be rooting and installing some other stuff once that becomes available but I definitely got to give you guys props on giving this update to us on time uh, there was a lot of talk that you might not make that February time frame and you pulled it off I'm absolutely in love with my transformer I have been uh, since I got it even though it wasn't that long ago but still I feel like I've renewed my vows with it now it's got ice cream sandwich on it if you haven't already gotten the update, kids, make sure to check your system settings. Uh, the update will take about 10 minutes to apply. Get yourself a coffee. Don't touch it while it's doing it. You know, be safe. Flash responsibly. And uh, get yourself your ice cream sandwich fix, kids. Make sure to check us out on AndroidSpin.com. We will be sharing all the greatest, latest, newest, everything that uh, possibly comes out for this tablet here in the coming weeks. I'm sure there's going to be tons of it, so make sure to stay tuned. Peace.